And we love him, Ryan Sampson. <laughs> You fill up my senses Like a night in a forest Like the mountains in springtime Like a walk in the rain Like a storm in the desert Like a sleepy blue ocean you fill up my senses Come fill me again Come let me love you Let me give my life to you let me drown in your laughter Let me die in your arms Let me lay down beside you Let me always be with you Come let me love you Come love me Like the mountains in springtime Like a walk in the rain Like a storm in the desert Like a sleepy blue ocean You fill up my senses Come fill me again you fill up my senses Come fill me again Come let me love you Come love me again Thank you very much. This is a, a song I recorded a little while ago, and uh, it's placed in a just outside of Tamworth, you know, about two and a half hours ish, in a place called Narrabri. I'm sure you've probably been there or been through it, seen it, heard about it. In Narrabri, there is a whole heap of cotton, and there's only a few roses. And if you're lucky enough to find one of your own, you hang on to it forever. You found yours, didn't you? Just keep it pruned, all right? Going back to Narrabri. Heading west with the sun in my eyes And the speedo says a hundred miles Up the bog of Briar Road The black top stretches out forever If this rust bucket will hold together I'll see the lights of Narra Briar tonight Cos I've seen the bridge in Sydney And I've rode the Melbourne tram Adelaide was a girl I knew before she started making plans But my heart belongs to New South Wales In the valley where the Namoy flows I'm going back to Narrabri To the cotton and the rose Tonight I'll find the cotton and the rose
You see, the Rose was only 17. She worked behind the counter in Doyle Street. And when she wasn't selling magazines, she'd spend a little time with me. Ah, oh, but after dark, we'd make our love down by the river on a travel rug and gaze at the cotton in the moonlight, Rose and me. Cause I've seen the bridge in Sydney and I've rode the Melbourne tracks. Adelaide was a girl I knew before she started making plans. But my heart belongs to New South Wales In the valley where the Nemoy flows I'm going back to Narrabri To the cotton and the rose Tonight I'll find the cotton and the rose You see the wanderlust has left me now in the years that I have known Drowned in the towns I left behind Washed up on the shores of home Bit of a country girl remembers me As a boy that she once chose I'll settle down in Narrabri With the cotton and the rose Cause I've seen the bridge in Sydney And I've rode the Melbourne tracks Adelaide was a girl I knew before she started making plans But my heart belongs to New South Wales In the valley where the Nemoy flows I'm going back to Narrabri To the cotton and the rose Tonight I'll find the cotton and the rose Ah, oh, the cotton and the rose oh, You're very kind, thank you I'd like to leave you with this song. It's a, I, I'd like to sing this one for every woman who's ever had a bloke tell her that her bum looked fat in something. <laughs> Marilyn Monroe was a size 14, the prettiest girl that the world had seen. She didn't look a lot like the supermodel women Who looked like the survivors of the Singapore prison Her bottom was round and her breasts were full And when her skirt flew up she was beautiful That full figure featured in a lot of man's dreams You tell her Marilyn Monroe was a size 14 The Women's Weekly and no idea They make a lot of cash from a constant fear That if you aren't skinny then you're bound to fail What they will never tell you is the average male Still prefers a woman with a few nice curves It's time to give the ad boys one big serve Scream right back at your TV screen You tell them Marilyn Monroe is a size 14 I could take a whole damn cast of friends I'd take them down to Tamworth for the long weekend I'll give those women what they really need A new perspective and a damn good feed You see a little boy's bottom's got a place in the world But it isn't on the body of a grown up girl That looks pathetic on a supermodel It's flogging cheap cosmetics in a plastic bottle there's still a few men in the world like me Who remember what a woman's body used to be That voluptuous figure in tight blue jeans Levi's, nah, Wrangler butts, they drive me nuts Marilyn Monroe is a size 14 hey!
If I could date the ladies on the TV soaps, I'd take them for a burger and I'd tell them that they ought to stop starving themselves and killing our kids, trying to make them into shapes that God never did. You see, the ad men's dollar and corporate greed, they'll never tell a woman what a real man needs. Because you won't win him working out in the gym, because what they really want is you working out on him. You say your body's too big and your shape is strange. It's your mind, not your body, that you need to change. So paint these words on your TV screen. You tell them Marilyn Monroe is a size 14 Don't let their scales outweigh your dreams You tell them Marilyn Monroe is a size 14 Don't buy their stupid magazines Until they use a few models who are size 14 Thank you very much, folks.